Hey everyone, this is Dakota France, and today is August 26th, 2018. I uh, wanted to make this video blog in order to make some commentary on some technical aspects as well as announce the next phase of what's going on with the dolls. So, let me just shut that real quick. My apologies. As you can see, we're in my old team uniform. Just dug this out. Still look good, don't it? Oh, anyway. For a while, anyway, going to the technical aspect. Uh, for a while now, I've seen a lot of groups that have started to use the Xbox 360 Connect, or even the Xbox One version of it, to try and capture paranormal activity. Microsoft, they want people to try to develop more software for it outside of gaming, so they make it readily accessible, even though the Connect has been discontinued from their service. It's almost impossible to get. I managed to find this one at a local thrift shop. So, anyway, I've done some looking research into the matter, and uh, as well as looked at, excuse me, some quote-unquote evidence that's been shared among social media, and to my conclusion. It's not worth the hype. I know that the uh, show Ghost Adventures uses similar technology based on a model built by Bill Chappell in order to build anomalies. But here's, here's the thing. The Kinect was not built to be portable. It was meant to be stationary. It was recommended to be like two to six feet off the ground and have a view and you can't really register jack shit until you're about six feet away from the camera now because these dingbats are constantly moving it it's messing with the sensor Microsoft even though they make their products readily accessible they want people to build and they're trying to innovate and all that good shit it's, that's all good has a tendency to fuck shit up. And the Kinect software, not so great. At most, it's a good infrared camera. That's about it. But the frame rate isn't that impressive. A typical 30 frames per second. It's not all that impressive. It's just not worth it. Now, to go into detail, a lot of these groups try to claim that the Skeletal tracking system. Oh, I got something perfect. Fuck. Anyway, part of my language. No, I don't. I don't give a shit. Anyway, skeleton tracking system. Hello, say hello to Woody. Anyway, is meant to say is to, like track this, right? You move your arm, it tracks your arm. You move your arm like that, it tracks your arm. La di 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 do. Move around. It uses the skeleton in order to basically map your moves and basically figure out what the hell you're trying to do. Now a lot of the groups, now if you're moving around, moving the camera, you know, ooh, you might think, oh, ooh, 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 it's a ghost, it's a ghost, it's a ghost, it's a ghost. When it's just the sensor flipping out and thinking maybe there's a weird thinking, getting confused. Basically, you're moving this damn thing around, you're making it dizzy. That's what it pretty much amounts to. So, sorry to say, but using the Kinect for ghost hunting might not be the best idea. Like I said, where its infrared sensor can actually act as a night vision camera, maybe that'll be useful. But it ain't worth the hype. So, 
That's what that amounts to. Anyway, uh, as far as Miss Man, for those of you who've seen my previous videos, those of you who have been introduced to Miss Mandy and Miss Dakota, I got to thinking it's honestly not right that I keep them around. It's not right that their spirits are still bound here. They have expressed concerns that they might want to move on. So, I'm going to do this. We're going to try to let them answer for themselves. Hello, Miss Mandy. I'm going to use a, dow use a dowsing pendulum. Hey, Mandy. I know we haven't talked in a few days, but you wanna. Is there something you wanna say? Can you show me what a yes looks like first? Alright, let's try this again. Mandy, can you show me a yes? Right, see that? Can you show me a no? Side to side. All right, Mandy, I want you to be completely honest with me. Do you look... All right, let's reset that. Do you like hanging out with me? Open. Do you want to move on? Let's try to reset that. Do you want to cross over? It's pulling a little harder now. Okay. Do you want me to help you? Alright. I'll set you down, okay? Miss Dakota. Your turn. All right. Say hello, everybody. All right. Dakota, can you show me a yes? Can you show me a no? Do you like hanging out with me? Okay. Do you want to cross over? See your family again? All right. I'll do it. This next experiment that I'm going to broadcast is uh, we're going to have to detach Dakota and Mandy from these dolls. And uh, we might have to give Michael a call again in order to help get them crossed over. They're here on their own free will. If they want to move on, there's ways you can help. I've got to do some research in order to make sure I do this correctly. And the ne next attempt 
is going to be to send him to heaven. So keep your eyes open. If you'd like to see more of these type of videos, leave a like, subscribe, find me on Instagram, Snapchat, YouTube. Of course, you're already seeing me on YouTube. You're watching this video right now. I'm touching it. <laughs> Facebook, Instagram, you know the drill. Keep an eye out for more videos. Next time you see me, we're going to cross some souls over. We're going to try to get it on camera. That's going to be an interesting prospect. I know I said the connect wasn't exactly the wisest decision, but I might try to use it. See if we can capture the light on the camera. This will be big if we can pull it off. So see you next time. Adios.